Derek and I work at Badger in Production and today we're going to take you through the process of making one of our products. One of my favorite products, Sleep Up. The product we'll be making today is here, Sleep Bomb. And the ingredients are very simple. Extra virgin olive oil, castor oil, beeswax, bergamot, lavender, rosemary, ginger, and balsam fir. All these ingredients are organic and we store them all here in our facility. This is a jar of our organic olive oil that we use here. Um, it's food grade and it's of excellent quality. And as you can see, it has a beautiful golden glow to it. Um, we use this in all of our products. It is uh, the staple of our business. So, the beginning of our base mix last night, it is a mixture of olive oil and castor oil. And this fat here holds all of our beeswax that we use in our product today. Um, just by pressing on this lever, it flows out. I'm going to pour it in five pound um, pre-measured lots and then add it slowly to our product. The wax is organic and it's from India and Canada. We run it through a filter just to make sure that we catch some of the natural matter that's floating in there because it is produced by bees and it's made on facility, so it's it's still pretty raw. Hi, I'm Jane. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, we're going to be pouring the essential oils. <clears throat> Organic balsam fir essential oil. The balsam fir itself, uh, just on its own, the first thing you can smell, it smells like Christmas. Yeah. It smells like a reed or a tree. I think it smells like wood chips. Wood chips. <laughs> <laughs> they put in your garden beds. <laughs> Organic rosemary verbenone essential oil. Organic ginger CO2 extract. Ginger CO2. Organic ginger essential oil. This oil is thinner and lighter in color. Organic bergamot essential oil. Okay. Organic lavender essential oil. Lavender. Lavender is my favorite essential oil. It's also nice to go home smelling like lavender, I think. These two beakers represent all the oil, essential oils that we're going to add to our vat. From this vat, now we will, these, are, these two pumps will suck the product up through and out to the next room where our machine is. We're going to run close to 9,000 tins today, which is a pretty big run for this size tin. A lot of this order is going out to one specific customer. We'll be packing it up off the end of the line, go directly from here to their facility. 